Hello. I actually, you know what? You know what? Let me let me check real quick. Is this recording? It better be recording. I swear. I swear. I swear. If you do not record, I'm gonna kill you, Cam. I'm gonna kill you. Not not whoever's watching this. I'm gonna kill this Cam. All right. Let's go. Hello, everyone. This is your boy Awesome Joe 18, aka Giovanni Huerta, and welcome to week five of the freaking PCL. Oh wait, PLCL. Okay whatever so this week we are taking on the midnight wolf oh wow my bad my bad i mean i'm taking on the north folk north folk north folk needle arenas aka midnight wolf now this guy was claiming on discord that he's gonna destroy me and honestly he might <laughs> uh, i looked at his team and honestly I don't know why he was scared of my team, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, he actually dropped a comment on my draft analysis breakdown of my team that I drafted, and he commented that I have the most scariest team, but when I look at my team and I compare it to Midnight, bro, look at this, look at this. Look, this is all terrifying power. You, you got Trapage, you got LGM, Rufflet, Bronsley, I mean Bonsly, Spritzy, Fanta, Porygon, Scraggy, Staryu, and Darumaka. That's, it's a pretty threatening team. You know, if he plays his cards right, he could win this week. And I will no longer be undefeated. So, and in terms of what I predict he might bring on his squad is the following. Spritzy, Porygon, Trapinch, Staryu, Phantom, and Bonsly. Now, other Pokemons that I think he might bring, instead of the Staryu, he might bring in Algium. Instead of Phanta, he might bring in Rufflet. Bonsly, instead of Bonsly, like Scraggy. But in the end, it's a fair game. His team is well-rounded. He doesn't have a fire type, but his team is powerful. Just know that. And in terms of my team, you guys already see it right here on the screen. So, you see Yamcha, you see Majin Buu, you see, I mean Majin Buu, <laughs> I think you guys know what the anime this one's from. So anyways, we got Ponyer, we got Corsola, we got Scyther, we got uh, Skrelp, Ponyta again, and my boy uh, Heliopto is coming back. I completely forgot his name. And these are the items I'm rocking it, being from top to bottom, being Choppleberry, Evil Light, Life Orb, I think that's a Shookaberry? If I'm not mistaken, Expert Belt and Choice Scarf. Now, this team is terrifying. I don't know how things are going to be going. So, without further ado, let's get this battle started, guys. Alrighty, so we are here. And honestly, man, I am terrified. Like I mentioned earlier, we're going up against Midnight. His team is so scary. You guys already know what team I thought he was going to bring. And you know what? I'm going to let another player decide because I, I, I'm, a, I'm a bit of a noob in this. So, I don't want to mess up any, anything else. But, yeah. Honestly, my heart is pumping from last week with Slightly Salty. That I should not have won that battle, by the way. I should not have won that battle. I should have lost, actually. But I'll take the Ws. I'll take the Ws, you know? I mean, they're not right deserved, but I'll take the Ws, you know? But hopefully week five, man, I don't know. This, this week is going to be very terrifying. I'm not going to lie to you. I really, 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 really hope we get a dub, but... You know, this week, I just started school, and if you guys have not watched my other video, you, you have to go ahead and check that out, because you guys already, you should, by now, already know that I'm in school, and now I'm a little bit stressed, but right now, this is a good stress reliever, but at the same time, I'm terrified, so this is my squad, so let's go and, without further ado, let's go and click this, oh my god, oh my god, let's go, I, I know you guys always hear the Marnie music, I guess I'll put something else, I, I don't know what, what, Oh, gym leader. You know what? Let's put the gym leader. I, I kind of like this theme. I kind of listen to this tune every now and then. So let's go with this. I am so terrified, guys. I, I don't know. <sighs> you could bring in good stuff, dude. You could bring in good stuff. You could bring in the good stuff. And I can't even... I can't even front, guys. You guys already know what I predicted for the squad. And let's see if we were right. I mean... I'm terrified. I'm terrified. My strat right now, if everybody in the PSL is watching this video, you guys already know my strat. So, I mean, I really can't hide it. So, you guys really could prepare for it. But, for the case that they don't they don't watch this, that's a good sign. <laughs> I know Goki is watching my battle, so Goki for that rematch, he's going to get me good. He's going to get me good, even though I'm watching his videos as well. But this guy, Midnight, I have not watched his videos. Actually, that's a fun fact. Uh, every single match I do every week, I have a tendency to go ahead and check the battles prior like what, what's their strategy and everything and holy frick he brought up he brought the algium he i know the star you trap pinch oh my god this is a problem guys 
He got the Algium. I was afraid of that. But he did not bring in the... What's I'm gonna call it? He did not bring in the fairy type. Frick, I forgot his name or her name. Is this good? I, I, I don't know. Scraggy is definitely gonna be a problem. I need to get rid of Scraggy. And then if I could get rid of Scraggy and Trap Pinch, I think I'm set. If I could get rid of Trap Pinch and Scraggy, I'm set. So I'm gonna bring in my boy Majin Buu. Uh, well, why not? Majin Buu, let's go. Uh, I, it's, it's a coincidence because this year is going to be the anniversary, or in a couple, in less than an hour, is the, the world celebration for Dokkan Battle is going live, and the fact that I picked Dragon Ball Z as my team for this week. Uh, I should have said that, you know, I forget, whatever. Uh, Alright, so we're going to start off with Majin Buu. Hopefully that is not the wrong choice. I have to set up the Stealth Rock. There's no way I cannot set up the Stealth Rock. He might predict it, and he might taunt me like... Week 1 with Q the Costa Rican. If you guys have not checked out that battle, definitely go ahead and check that out. There should be a card right here. Oh my god. Guys, I'm so I'm so terrified. I don't... I, I, I'm not gonna front... Oh my god, my mouse is in here. He brought Rufflet. He brought Rufflet. This is a good sign. This is a good sign. Okay. He better not taunt me, though. Can I get the Stealth Rock in? Can I get this in? I, I really want the Stealth Rock. He didn't bring the Bonsley either. I, actually, I'm surprised he didn't bring the Bonsley. <sighs> free rocks. Free rocks. Free rocks. Free rocks. Free rocks. Free rocks. Free rocks, guys. Free rocks. I don't. I don't care. Free rocks. Free freaking rocks. I need to get these rocks. <sighs> you son of a gun. Already being a threat. What does this thing have, though? I have to set up the Stealth Rock. I have to set up the Stealth Rock. Hmm. Okay. For this Porygon, it all depends on what he... What does he have for me, though? Hmm. Really good question. I mean, I can't stay in. I can't. I'd be in... Um, I want to go into Yamcha though. Basing off of his team, I have 30 seconds, right? Basing off of his team, Ponyard does go ham on his team. Don't get me wrong. It does go ham on his team. But I have Scyther. So if he sets up his own rocks, that's good. I mean, fine. Whatever. I'll be fine with it. I'm going to go into Yamcha. It's not my- I really don't- this Corsola like, can't really do anything against Porygon. And I know this is his EVL idol user, but if he predicts Flamethrower... Ooh, bro. Bro. Oh, yes. Alright. This is it. I'm gonna go for a knockoff. I'm gonna knock off that item. I- I don't even care right now. I'm just gonna knock it off. I I'm not gonna care. I- I- whatever you wanna bring in, bring it in, fam. Bring it in, fam, but- But- but my boy is surviving. My boy's surviving here. Ponyard, Ponyard, go go home on this team. He's gonna bring in Scraggy. Five bucks. Five bucks. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He might bring it. Oh, if he brings in Scraggy, yo. If he brings in Oh my god, bring in Scraggy. Oh my god, he's gonna bring in Scraggy! Oh my god. Oh, Moxie? What, what is he gonna bring? Choice banned. Choice banned. I really don't have much for this guy. Could he pack something that could destroy me? Could he have rock slide? I have no one that could do damage enough for this to go down. I I believe in my boy though. All right, I'm gonna go in Vegeta. Ah, I hopefully he did not go for the rock slide. If he goes through the rock slide, that's big. That is freaking big right now. If he goes through the rock slide. Oh, ice punch, even worse. 
Ugh. Okay. You mother fudgers! He, I, he managed to freeze me. Oh, wow. Wow. Wait, am I? He's a dark type? Wait a second. Oh my god, I just lost sight through the most stupidest way possible. Yeah. Yeah, that was something. Oh, wow. Oh, Vegeta's down. Man, Vegeta is so pissed. He would be pissed off at me. Oh, he'd be like, you! You fool! Alright. All right. All right. Damn, this is... I just lost Vegeta. This is big. Wait, does that say Iron Defense? That says Iron Defense. Oh my god, I gen this mon wrong. Alright, whatever. I'm just gonna go for the Brick Break. Screw it. Oh my god, I'm just gonna go for it. I know it might not ki it, it could have killed. Wow. I just lost sight there the most stupidest way possible. I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed as- As- As being week 5, I feel ashamed now. Vegeta! Vegeta! Oh my god. I am so intense right now. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. Okay. If I deserve to- If I- If I lose this, I deserve to lose this. Lose this. I have no reason why not to go back into- my boy Majin Buu. I have no reason. I have no reason why not to go back to Majin Buu. I have no reason. I have no other reason. I need Ponyard. Ponyard is definitely like my my baby. My baby. Who's gonna clutch this for your boy? He's my baby. Baby! Majin Buu! You have knockoff? That'd be interesting. So actually for this set for Corso I, I apologize for the commentary. Dude, I I, I can't believe I forgot about Prick. I did not know Scraggy was a dark type. I, I, I completely forgot. I thought he was a pure fighting type. But whatever. Okay. I think that's the worst case scenario. Worst case scenario that Porygon again? Oh, uh, he went for Shadow Ball the first time around. His attack rose. Hmm. Actually, give me a sec, give me a sec, give me a sec. Who who do I not need for this match? I want to go with somewhere different. Actually, to be completely honest. Ponyta really won't be able to do much. Yeah. That's a sad truth. Ponyta won't be able to do much. I guess I'm just going to go ahead and sack it off. Alright, Kakarot, I'm gonna lose both the duels, the powerful duels of Dragon Ball Z, I'm gonna lose them. He's gonna think I'm gonna go back into Ponyard, but I'm not. Screw that. Yep, he was gonna go for the- I, I had a feeling he, was, he might go for the Thunderbolt. Don't you freaking pair- What the frick? <laughs> what? Okay, that is some- That is some complete butterscotch here. Wow. 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 What's with this crap? <laughs> okay, whatever. This is some... This is some BS. <laughs> yeah, I'm going for the double kick. Oh my god, if I get killed... Trick room? Yes? Trick room? Alright, I, I was prepared for that, man. I was prepared for that. I was prepared for that trick room. I never thought Porygon would get it, though. And I get... <sighs> I deserve to die. This is... This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad for your boy. I have to go into Bulma. This is bad. This is bad. I'm gonna go into Bulma. This is bad. This is bad.
I have to go for Sludge Wave. This is bad. Thunderbolt. It might kill. Yeah. This is bad. I really don't got much. I don't. I lost this, dude. I, I, I really can't do much. Alright, I'm just gonna go back into... This is some... I have to Volt Switch. I don't want to, though. Oh my freaking god, I misplayed. Oh, never mind. I mean, I might die here, to be honest. That is not even enough. That is not even enough. That is not even enough. I have to go into Majin Buu. I have to go back into Majin Buu. I have to. This is... Well... Can't say much about this. <laughs> oh my god. This is bad. Oh my god. Cursed body. Shadow ball is disabled. Oh yeah, yeah, I told you guys I was gonna make bad plays for this week. Oh my god. Porygon is finally dead, but half of my team is pretty much dead either way, so. <sighs> I mean I mean there's a chance. There's a chance I can I could still come back from this one. There is still a chance. But it's very, very small. It is just very small. Actually... What would you go for? Good question. You know what? I'm just gonna go for the Shadow Ball. Alright. <laughs> oh man. Okay, here here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. Alright, we're we're already on the final stretch, guys. Uh I might as well just keep it in, honestly. I might as well keep it in. I might as well keep it in. Here goes nothing. Here goes nothing. He's gonna think I'm gonna go for the volt switch. And I hope he does think I do that. Because I'll surf every time. I'll surf every time. I'll surf. I'll surf. Go into freaking trap pinch. Go to go into trap pinch, my boy. Go into trap pinch. Yeah. Go into trap pinch. Go into trap pinch, my boy. Go into trap pinch. Yeah. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You know what? That is my highlight. Surf it up, boys. Surf it up. Surf it up. Get rid of that trap pinch. Okay. Your boy's still not home, though. Your boy is still not home. He's still not home. Your boy is still not home from this. Ah, oh, frick. There is no way I can win this, though. There is no way I can win this. I could lower the differentials, not gonna lie. Is there any way I can do this? I don't think so. Nah, there's no way your boy can pull through. I mean, I do need Algium. So, let's go to Yamcha. I mean, Goten can really clutch this, so... Parabolic charge is a thing. Parabolic charge is a thing, so I'm just gonna go into Yamcha. And hopefully he just doesn't kill me off. He's gonna go for the Surf. Alright then. Yeah, Yamcha's dead. Oh well. Oh well, that's GG. I completely forgot all about it. Uh, I'm just gonna try to live up as many hits as I can. Uh, I'm gonna close it. Honestly, there was so much hacks in this battle, I, it caused me to lose. Yeah.
And I'm just gonna go for the parabolic charge. And that's all I can do. So let's go for that. Bam! Let's go. I kill off Staryu. I'm Choice Guard. I think Choice Guard was a burden. A little bit. So hopefully... If I could kill off the LGM or in a way... Do enough damage that the LGM could go down. Then I might have a chance. But other than that, I think that's... That's just game. If he has Focus Blast or something like that. Or the sort. I'm dead. I have to go. I wish I wish I could go for the Dark Pulse, you know. <laughs> Alright, let's go for the Parabolic Charge. Hope for the best. Let's just hope for the best. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man, that is... That is... That is sweet. If he packs the Focus Blast. What's that? Berry Juice? Trick Room! Trick Room! You say. Wow. Alright. You know what? Good job. You actually deserve the dub. You actually deserve the dub. <laughs> I complete. I honestly completely forgot about the... What's it call it? I completely forgot about the Brick Break. If not, Vegeta would have still been alive. And that, you know what? It was, I told you guys. I knew it was going to go bad. Uh... Alright, oh my god, it's 2.30 already. Alright then. So if you guys enjoyed this battle, definitely, it, definitely drop down a like, comment down below what was your favorite part. And as always, consider subscribing because there's more PLCL content. Week 5 was the week that I lost, unfortunately, but we're gonna still keep on going. Honestly, I, I'm actually glad that I lost week 5. It, you know, it actually brings me, calms me down. It's like, it's not that much pressure and I could think more. So the fact that I snapped out, I snapped right with the... With the the surf with the Helio tile, that was so clutch. So, anyways, this has been your boy Asajuri Teen, and I'll see you in week six. All right, peace. <laughs>